The only problem with this guy is he's not English. Hardy looking for runners. Biggest sends it out wide. And a bit of pressure now. George Nordlaw bots out wide. It's a two on one. A chance coming up. Reese Zimmer. Reese Zimmer's got the base. A dream start for the Dragons. Ball out wide into space. Damien Vinonsa comes across to close up. Too late. The pace of Lewis Rees-Zammert gets Wales on the scoreboard. You need big dominant guys, there's no point in giving the ball to Louis rees and saying on you go, actually needs to have some go forward and some space to operate in. It's Hastings, they may have an opportunity to go here, it's rees Samet right on cue, breaks through the line, the full back into the 22, he's going to go the whole way! Oh, perfect timing from Louis rees Samet. For Gloucester's first try. Him to distribute, he, he draws so much defence. Look, Hamish Watson drawn on to Dave Cherry on him. Just makes space elsewhere. And then you get this guy one on one. Makes it look easy. No one even touches him. It's an unbelievably good finish. Chapman. Hastings on to 12 trees. Seabrook, terrific offload. A real chance. Oh, what a stunning run. Well, the Wales coach sent him home to rediscover his form. No momentum. Varney, 12 trees, Evans, May, Rizamit steps on the gas. Oh, my goodness, the acceleration is something to behold, isn't it? Lewis Rizamit with yet another for Gloucester. Just a stunning finish, the acceleration. Absolutely electric, almost indefensible. That's better ball. Quick ball for them now, getting it in behind. Josh Adams perfectly positioned. Now this man's got pace, boy. I can tell you what. Resummit. Goodbye, Nurse. Off he goes. He's not even having to show it. And it's another try for the British and Irish Lions. Right. Bit of aimless kicking from the shots. The head position. If you keep the ball, you limit the chances of the opposition scoring against you. The transitional play from the British-Irish Lions, turning that defence into attack. Yeah, the ball not going deep enough, not really testing Josh Adams. And then after that, just putting the ball into space. And straight from the kickoff, Gloucester continued to put the Frighteners right up the Tigers with their fifth try. An outstanding length of the field effort, eventually finished off by Rhys Samet, a brilliant young winger's second score. The conversion went wide, meaning Gloucester trailed by three. Oh, here we go. Oh, off he goes, Lewis Rhys Samet. He's creating mayhem oh. all on his own. I'm not oh. sure anyone's going to stop him. That is amazing. The only problem with this guy is he's not English. <laughs> it's a stunning finish, isn't it? What I love is the late decision. He hasn't pinned his ears back and thought, I'm going to go myself from the, the initial break. He makes the initial break, looks to his outside. There's no one else really there. Well, he, he makes that decision that I'm in a better position to score this than anyone on my left shoulder. Beard moves it to Hallaholo. Goes beyond Falatau to the fly, Lewis Rees Zammert, Lewis Rees Zammert chasing down his own kick, and Lewis Rees Zammert, he's going to get there, what a try, what a try from this wonderful young winger. What superb skill to, to create that chip when you're running at full pace, that's such a, a hard, underestimated skill, fantastic from Lewis Rees Zammert to, to back himself against Jordan van der Merwe. Charges back round on the other angle, Sharples can perhaps dart through a gap there, Sharples waits for it, Rees Zammert, Rees Zammert, what can he do against Hooley, can just leave him for dead and then heads for the corner, Whiteley flies across, but Rees Zammert finishes off with real class. Nick Tonkins wide to the speedster and Lewis Rees Zammert chasing down his own kick and look at him go, look it. at him move, he might win this race, oh! Lewis Rees 
That is his great talent. There are parts of his game which he knows he has to improve, but while he 